So you might be in a situation where you wanted to go ahead and essentially back up or export all the messages you have on your Android. Now, this is actually a pretty basic process and it really doesn't, you know, it doesn't take too much time up. The very first thing you're going to want to do though, is you want to go ahead and find a particular, you know, find the message app, whatever message app you're using, and then go ahead and make your way over to your Play Store. So open up your Google Play Store and you want to download some sort of SMS backup and restore, you know, application. In this case, I've used this one personally before, SMS Backup and Restore. It's a it's a pretty decent one, it's not perfect, but it gets the job done. There's a lot of other ones you can use if you want to, but this is the one that I normally use, this one right here. So you can use this one, you can use another one. You just need some sort of SMS Backup and Restore tool. So now what you wanna do is you wanna install that application and you wanna go ahead and open it up. Now when you do that, you'll basically come into this type of page. And what you're going to wanna do here is you wanna go and click on Get Started. Now you want to give it access to pretty much everything that it asks for. And at that point, what's going to happen is it's going to allow you to go ahead and start a backup. So now what you can do is you can click set up a backup, which is right there. And it's going to ask you what you basically want to back up. So you can back up your messages, your call logs, whenever you choose whatever you want to, you can go and click next. And then you can choose where you want to drop it off at. Now you can basically export it to Google Drive. You can go ahead and export it to your phone which is pretty much an easier thing to do if you don't want to access or give it access to your Google Drive, whatever. Then you can go and click next, just click yes, so read what you're doing. You can schedule recurring backups if you want to. You can do that, you know, you don't have to if you don't want to, but then you can click backup now. And this will go ahead and export your messages basically from your message application into this panel right here. So now it can take a little bit of time. I don't know if it's automatic or something, but at that point, that's pretty much all you're going to have to do. At this point on, you should be able to go through and just, you know, use that application and you can back up all your information, everything from there. And that pretty much will cover it up. It's super basic. You can find a backup and then go ahead and restore from there. And it will be saved inside of your files application after a certain amount of time. So that's pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.